The Suicide Squad is once again coming to wreak unholy havoc on the world of superhero movies. And if the first look footage James Gunn and company unleashed during DC Fandom is any indication, the director may have outdone even himself with how far he's willing to push the envelope of insanity. For many diehard DC Comics fans, the panel for James Gunn's anti-superhero team-up flick The Suicide Squad was the panel to watch during the online Fandom event. Gunn didn't disappoint, bringing virtually the entire cast of the film into the arena via an awesome Zoom session. The reveal capped things off with a look at some behind-the-scenes footage, complete with cast interviews and a few finished scenes from the movie. What should we expect from the film? We'll let Gunn answer that question. It's going to be different from any superhero movie ever made. While Gunn's signature sense of humor isn't fully on display in the new promo video, the director's penchant for wild, over-the-top action is. And it promises to be the sort of unabashedly goofy bombast only Gunn can deliver. It's easy to see why Warner Brothers and DC Entertainment executives were so eager to snatch Gunn up after his brief firing from Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy Vol. 3. Gunn's flair for outlandish action was on full display in the first two Guardians of the Galaxy movies. And if you have any familiarity with Suicide Squad writer John Ostrander's comics, you'll agree that Gunn's twisted sensibilities are particularly well-suited to bring the comics to life. The Suicide Squad promo reveals a few returning anti-heroes from 2016's much-maligned first attempt at the Suicide Squad property, as well as a swath of new characters from the DC Comics canon. It finds Gunn dropping them all into a literal war zone, rife with big guns, super-powered individuals, and explosive set pieces. Everyone is exploding genitals, heads, arms, legs. In fact, most of the footage in the promo shows Gunn and his effects crew gleefully blowing stuff up. Elsewhere, there are several intriguing looks at new members of the Suicide Squad team. Gunn teases a wild CGI version of Weasel, played by his brother Sean Gunn, Michael Rooker is sporting a crazy blonde wig as Savant, and John Cena makes his first appearance as Peacemaker. Not everyone on the Suicide Squad roster makes an appearance in the promo footage, but we know almost all the facts about the cast. Gunn has assembled an absolutely mammoth group of actors for the Suicide Squad. There are several actors reprising their roles from David Ayer's original Suicide Squad. Margot Robbie returns as Harley Quinn, as does Joel Kinnaman as Rick Flagg, Viola Davis as Amanda Waller, and Jai Courtney as Captain Boomerang. It doesn't stop there, either. We're also getting Daniela Melchior as Ratcatcher 2, Nathan Fillion as TDK, Alicia Braga as Solsoria, Lula Borg as Javelin, and Pete Davidson as Blackguard. And still, the cast goes on. An interesting side note about one of the cast members. Idris Elba was initially in talks to play Deadshot when Will Smith had to drop out of the role. We're very curious to see what Elba's take on Bloodsport looks like as a result. One thing you'll notice from the cast reveal trailer is that there is one star whose Suicide Squad role hasn't been announced yet, Taika Waititi. We can't wait to see what character the What We Do in the Shadows actor is going to play and what is sure to be the most insane superhero movie ever made. The Suicide Squad is set for release on August 6, 2021, so fans should get plenty more information about the movie between now and then. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about the DC Fandom and the Suicide Squad are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.